Hey, Tommy V from 8-1 Real Estate. Do you want to know how to accurately calculate rent for your properties so that when you pull up the rental property calculator, you're putting in numbers that make sense and are accurate so that you can increase your confidence, reduce your risk, and reduce your stress? There's a ton of these tools out here. One of the easiest ones I've used is Rent-O-Meter. Uh, so in another video, we analyzed this deal that came into my email from a wholesaler. It's 6365 Katoma Street. Right, come over here. And yep, looks like it found it in here. Our rent that the wholesaler told us was $1,500 a month. It's a three bedroom. It's one and a half baths. And we'll hit analyze see what it tells us. So according to this cool tool here, it tells us that 1500 is reasonable for the area. Average rent is 1588, 1595 for median, and it kind of gives you this little meter here of where it falls. So we'd say that 1500 is probably pretty reasonable for this area. Uh, this service has some pro options and upgrades and things like that. Uh, the other big thing to know is to just know the median rent for your whole market it's really going to increase your supply demand in your favor and help keep your vacancy low because more people are going to want your property. So as you know, an investor in Jacksonville, Florida, I know for a fact that the median rent right now is $1,384. So if you can have a property renting for $1,384 or below, you're going to be capturing the largest number of people wanting to rent your house. And if you make that property super nice and more desirable, you're going to have no problem getting that uh, rent, that price point. If you'd, if you'd like to download my rental property calculator, I'm going to leave a link below. And so you can use it to analyze your deals and be a very successful real estate investor. Thanks a lot.